and Floyd returned to the ring. Oh uh, yeah, funny as shit. <laughs> <laughs> funny as shit. Um, Floyd actually took a couple. He took a couple shots in this fight. Yeah. The Japanese kid, I yeah. can't pronounce his name, yeah. so I don't want to be disrespectful. But the, the Japanese kid looked like he could fight. Yeah, he's pretty good. Um, but Mayweather, he having fun, man. He cashing out some more. Like, I mean, whenever you could travel the world and get paid for what you're doing on a, on a smaller scale, but they still making it look like pay-per-view type shit. Like, over there, that's some pay-per-view shit to mm -hmm. them. You know what I mean? To Floyd, it's a sparring session. Even though they, they got on 10-ounce gloves and they really was getting it in. It's, I mean, it was funny to watch. It was funny to see, especially to see his bodyguard get knocked out after putting his hands on that guy. You know what I mean? Pushing him. He didn't have to do that. You know what I mean, yeah, and yeah. I didn't know he was fighting, so he should have been know. more focused on what he yeah, had. Yeah, I going. didn't know that either, but yeah, he, yeah, he pushed the he pushed the guy for him and Floyd having a face off, and yo, oh, this is what sells fights, face yeah. off. Yeah, he got he got he got his ass whooped, but Floyd, Floyd having a good time, and I can't and I heard a couple people saying, oh, he need to hang it up, he gonna get hurt. First of all, he a fighter. You can't tell a fighter when they should hang it up because it's it's it's, it's an addiction, and, and it's it's something when it's something you love, you feel like you got to do it. You know what I mean? So, Floyd just having fun, man. He's just having fun. He's doing his thing. Uh, is it is it going to be the new thing nowadays? Well, because I know Ali used to do it back in the day, where Ali would travel uh, for um, you know crowds that's never seen Ali. Yeah. Exhibitions. Do you yeah. think that like that's a brilliant move and bringing it back? Because I think Floyd's never fought in Japan. He's never, he didn't fight in Dubai before. Yeah. So. I think it's a brilliant move. I think it's a lucrative move. The problem is everybody won't be able to do it. Mm -hmm. Everybody's not an attraction. Floyd has become an attraction over the years where they want to see him. They have to see him. So now they're paying for it. And it, I mean, if you in position to do it, do it. Why not? If you can still make the kind of money you was making and you just beating up on lesser opponents. Why not do it? He having fun, man. He's, he's definitely found a void in the market. Does this take away from real boxing in your eyes? No, I think this is Floyd being Floyd. This is some shit separate from boxing, but it's still boxing. Like, it's boxing, but it's like, oh, in the other news, Floyd knocked somebody out in Japan. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? It's some shit like, all right. This is like his fourth exhibition mount? Fourth yeah. or fifth exhibition mount? Yeah, having a good time, man. He's just doing his thing. And he's getting a lot of guys paid, though. Yeah, that's the thing. And that's why you can't be mad. You got guys who we've never heard of, probably still won't hear about him after this, but guess what? They're getting a good little check fucking around with Floyd Mayweather. You know what I mean? Is this good for the sport? It's, it's good for the guys inside of the sport, the fighters. And the guys on the undercards and stuff? Yeah, it's good for them. It's an opportunity. Uh, you got a fighter, Jabril Noble. Would you put him on one of these cards? Uh, long as, long as everything right. You know what I mean? Getting paid right and, and it's the right situation. And we definitely do it. Why not? Get a chance to travel the world, have fun, doing what we do. Okay.